Hey what's up guys, Tech Titan here and meet the OnePlus Nord N300 5G. So this is supposedly the successor to the OnePlus Nord N200 and right off the bat, well real quick, so this phone was announced a couple of days ago and is set to launch in November 3rd at T-Mobile and I believe Metro by T-Mobile at that point. A uh, couple of things that I want to talk about. First of all, uh, this is a very reminiscent design of the OnePlus Nord N20, so this is kind of where this phone gets its inspiration from, and a couple of specs that you should know. So with this device here, you will get a 6.56 inch, only 720p panel, so it's going to be IPS and it's going to be LCD. Uh, however, it is going to support 90Hz refresh rate, so you get that going for it. Um, the display may not be its strongest suit, and it is a letdown but listen for the price that you're going to be paying for this phone not too shabby it's just not competitive enough now as far as processing power goes you will get the mediatek dimensity 810 which is a six nanometer arch based architecture it's going to be octa core and for the gpu you will get the mali g57 mc2 gpu 64 gigabytes of standard storage and four gigabytes of ram the, as far as the camera goes, you will have two sensors. One would be the 48 megapixel main sensor at f1.8 aperture, and you will get a two megapixel depth sensor. So we will see how this camera performs once I get it in house. But so far off of impressions, like I said, it seems to be very reminiscent to the, to the OnePlus Nord N20, but kind of a big downgrade if you ask me. I wish the display was at least 1080p. If they're not going to provide us with OLED, I don't see why they can't just make it 1080p. However, I understand that this may not be the best spec phone out there so far, and it seems to be a lack of a letdown, but it does have a 5,000 milliamp hour battery and up to 33 watts of fast charging. Huh. So definitely a questionable device if you ask me, but I will get it in-house. We're going to take it and test it do what we do and see how this phone works out so i just wanted to make this video and I'm, I'm curious to see how this phone plays out all right with that being said i mean i just want to thank you guys for watching this quick one if you enjoyed it make sure you leave a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this let me know i'll make it happen so thank you all so much for watching and you best assure that we're going to be testing this phone out and i will catch you guys in the next video thank you for watching